what is a couple? <laughs> the couple? Nah, the, the two two of them over there don't know doing what over there in that corner. There's a couple. Kind of, yeah, but in physics, couple is a slightly different meaning. <laughs> in physics, when you say a force of a couple or talk of a couple, moment, it means there are two forces. Same magnitude, but then they are both pointing in exactly opposite directions. So if this is 5 Newton, it's also 5 Newton. And uh, if you track their line of action, they have to act on different different, different locations. So if you are spinning a, a, a round thing here, then this object will start to spin. Thanks to this fo these two forces. So it's kind of like that. Or the other way, like that. You rotate an object. That's the talk of a couple. So we got to look and see oh, which one is it. Pair of forces. Let's look at A. Acting in the same direction but along different lines. Same direction. Hello, you need to be in different direction. Nope. B. Equal and opposite but acting along different lines. Okay, sounds pretty correct. Let's look at C. Pair of forces that produce no resultant force and no resultant moment. Okay, no resultant force is correct. Because we look at the diagram. Find Newton up, find Newton down. This object is not going to fly anywhere. However, there is a resultant moment clockwise for this diagram that I draw. So this object will start to spin on the spot, but it won't fly away. So, nah, this is not the answer already. D, a pair of unequal forces. Okay, that's, that's wrong. If you're a couple, you gotta have the same magnitude. Alright? Acting in opposite directions, but along the same line. Okay. Uh, same line cannot lah. You need different lines. No. 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 B is the best choice for this statement. So go check out the definitions, refresh a little bit if you forgot what's a couple in physics, and you'll be okay.